Recently, I asked myself, how can I take my success, happiness, and spirituality to the next level? And then the answer came to me in two words, Tony Robbins. So I decided to go to his Unleash the Power Within event. But before I went, I prepped for the event big time because I wanted to make sure that I could release the most amount of my inner power onto the outer world as possible. I got all his books and to really absorb the wisdom they hold instead of reading them like a mindless underachieving bastard, I just put them on my vision board. It's way more effective because I'm not using outdated action. I'm using the law of attraction. It brings the wisdom from Tony's books directly into my mind without me having to use my mind. I also watched I Am Not Your Guru on Netflix like it was going out of style. What did I get from it? I learned that Tony is not your guru, but I am your guru. You can stamp that. It doesn't even matter though, because now I was ready for the event. Right after I rubbed it in all my friends' faces that I was going and they weren't. The energy of the event was like a raging river of passion and excitement. I dove in head first. Mother Teresa always said, if you're not willing to get crazy, then don't go to the fucking party. I brought this spiritual principle to the event with me. At the event, I definitely wanted to get the best seat in the house, so I arrived early so that I could claim my up close and personal spot I rooted in. The most important life-changing question that I contemplated during the event was, how can I increase my social media street credit from being here? Answer, a little something I like to call stage selfies. They make all my friends think it's just Tony and I hanging together all weekend. They unleash my power within big time. What did I learn from the event? How to be in peak state. Yes! 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 Physiology, focus, and language determine your state. Which I think is Tony's way of saying drink more coffee. Which I did. Now I can tap into unstoppable energy anytime. Feel that? Tony also taught that there's one of two fears at the root of all dysfunction. The fear of not being loved or the fear of not being enough. Maybe for some people, but come on bro, I don't have any fears. I'm too spiritual for that. All I have is love and light. Then we did a fire walk, but before we did it, someone got so scared that they peed in my pants. Definitely wasn't me. Point is, I came out on the other side much stronger. I paid exquisite attention the entire time. I wasn't going to let a single insight get past me. For me, it's world-class concentration all day, every day at UPW. Other parts of the event, Tony took us through compassionate heart healing exercises. I take healing seriously, which means I was fully engaged with these the entire time. I'm practically a vulnerability expert. Brene Brown would be proud of me. There's 12 to 15 hour days during the event. It's no joke. So I knew it'd be important to have good nutrition to stay focused. I made sure to bring lots of nutrient dense snacks to keep my blood sugar steady and my body alkaline. Extremely alkaline. Ultra alkaline. The one point of contention I have with Tony's message, he's all about inner fulfillment being more important than achievement. Come on. Inner fulfillment has never fulfilled my bank account. Happiness might only be found within, but money sure as hell isn't. And you can't spell fulfill without ill. Think about that before you prioritize fulfillment. And now after UPW, I've had to be careful how I integrate back into my normal life so that I don't strain relationships with friends and family. How do I do that? I aggressively push everything I learned on other people who have no context to understand it. Obviously. You're getting your six human needs met wrong because you're broken inside from your relationship with your father. You should cut him out of your life completely. That doesn't make any sense. I'm not doing that. That sounds like a limiting belief to me. It's effective, it helps them, and they appreciate me for my newfound ability to make unsolicited demands about how they should live their life. And I think they feel more loved and accepted when I point out how they're defective and flawed and what they should do to be better. Now I'm all about being in a peak state. In fact, I'm never not in a peak state. Yes! Woo! 
I just need a hug. Not until you're in peak state. Your energy is just too low for me right now. Make a move. Yes! I've been watching your videos for years, man. I got you a gift. One high five, one hug. <clears throat> Woo! Get off my property. Life will never be the same. On a serious note, if there ever was such a thing, the Unleash the Power Within event that I went to made a dramatically positive impact on my life. All seven of my chakras and me recommend it. Be sure to unleash your power within by liking my Facebook page.